Uh, Ian, big game against Havant coming up on Saturday and we need to bounce back after Chesterfield. Yeah, disappointing uh, result against Chesterfield. Um, Performance-wide, everybody said we played well, um, but I think it's quite indicative of where we are this season. Uh, we played well to a point. As soon as we got in the final third of the pitch, um, we were disappointed in the game. But um, we've got a good game coming up against Havant. Uh, they're fighting for their lives. Uh, they need to win the game, so there is something on the game. And we're doing, we'll be doing our better, very, very best to, uh, to finish the season well. He said after the game on Saturday, Dylan Kearney was uh, one of the, the bright, uh, bright sparks we had. And he, the last home game we had against Gates had he scored. So hopefully we can want him to continue that good start with us. Yeah, Dylan's been a breath of fresh air. You know, he's a young lad who's come from a lower league. Um, he's come with a hell of a lot of enthusiasm. Uh, he listens to what you say and he wants to achieve a lot. Um, you know, and he's, he's proved that he can score goals at this level. Um, but you're always only as good as your last game. And uh, Dylan will be desperate to score again on Saturday. I was just thinking to Jonathan Barn and he still thinks we have a hope of the playoffs. And uh, Ebsley didn't win in midweek <laughs> as well. So that, obviously it's, it's looking pretty tricky, but we've still got a, a chance if we can get a, a late run together. I think we'd have to win probably five out of six games and hopefully the likes of Eastley, because I think they're in pole position, but they've got two games in hand. I think they're the favourites to get there, but you know, as I said just a minute ago, we'll be doing our very, very best to, to finish the season on a high. And last year, uh, Jonathan Barnum as well has come into midfield and um, played very well. Yeah, John's, um, unfortunately for him, he's been out for a year um, and he came to us just to train, um, but he showed a little bit in training. Uh, and he's shown another one who's shown the desire and the appetite to want to play for us. Um, unfortunately for him, he came off with cramp on Saturday, but I think that's why you know he has, he's been out for a year. But he's trained well this morning, as has Jamie Collins, um, so they'll all be available for selection. And also, if we can win on Saturday, it'd be good to get some home form together in the run-in. Yeah, absolutely. You know, the fans have stuck by us this season. I think we're tenth in the attendances in the league. Might even be a little bit lower, but. You know, the fans have been tremendous at home and hopefully we can give them something to cheer about on Saturday. Uh, Ian, thanks for talking to SGS TV and good luck for Saturday's game. Thank you very much.